My name is Calvin Winters. I'm not a bad man. Just misunderstood. I tried to let go of my criminal past. So I moved to the city of Los Angeles. I met new people. At the time, I even considered them my friends. A new star. But your past will always catch up to you eventually. Fucking back way. We no, don't drive the way we came in. Oh fucking. Wait, can oh, you see them? Can you see them? No, I'm just a bit scared. Come down here. Down here. We've got a bonus pick for you, mate. Oh you prick. Stop running. Fuck you! Back, Jared. What are you doing, mate? Jared. <laughs> what are you doing? Bring out the fucking bat, mate. I'll bring out the fucking gun cut. What are you doing? Mate, we, we need to fucking drive! Get in, fucking out. Need to get in! This is it. This is how my story ends. In order to move away from my past, the moment I got to Los Santos, I got myself a job delivering packages for a local firm selling electronic, gardening equipment, and an assortment of other crap no one wants. Not the best job, but it pays the bills and it's legal. I was almost done finishing my shift when a bike attempted to pull me over and presumably try to steal the contents of my van. I wasn't going to let that happen. The fuck you doing? Hey buddy, fuck you. Hey! Asshole. As if like that, I had gone back to my old ways. Violence before reason. I needed to get out of there before the police arrived. And I didn't know at the time, but the person I was fighting was an enemy of mine. And this was not the first time our meetings ended in conflict. Ah! Ah, Jamie, hello. Hello there, buddy. Mr. Calvin. See so you're uh, still going for the uh, the Gallagher uh, impersonation there. Yeah, bro. Liam Gallagher is the name. Liam Gallagher is the game. That's what they say. Understandable. Here's my um, interpretation, if you want to hear. It's me, Liam Gallagher. That's all I've got so far, but... Um, you know, I'm building on that. Pretty good, not gonna lie, pretty good. No, I got a gun. Hey, hey, hey what, the, what the fuck are you doing? Who's this? Hey, man. How's it going? Hello, boys. It's me. Who the fuck He's is that? He's off my boy! He's off my boy! Please stop pointing that gun around. Sorry, mate. You got a problem? Come to Bruma, spark you. 
The guy in the fur coat. That's Jamie. Liam Gallagher impersonator. It's uh, sort of what he does. The other guy, the one in the yellow jacket, that's Jareth. And I'm sure that was the one I saw up north. Knowing there'd be trouble, I thought I'd get myself a gun, just to be sure. Calvin, mate, we're going to the pub, mate. Do you want to come? Sounds very good. Sounds very good. Oi, uh, Jareth, mate, do you want to come in here, mate? Okay, mate, come on. All right, mate, you lead the way, mate. Drive the bar, now you let's go. Oh, we had somehow fine. managed to he's lose Jareth on the way to the bar. However, he told us to meet at a local garage where he'd pick us up. I assume we dropped him in Watson. Uh, this looks like uh, Lady Penelope from, uh, what is it, Thunderbirds? Hey guys. All right, lads, first class, mate, first class. Get in, not the front, not the front. <laughs> I'm all, uh, belly just saying there's a bar on the left. Just bar on the left. There, there, left, left, there we go. Let's go in there. Oh yeah, boys. What the fuck? Is a car parked around back, Jared? What are you doing, mate? Jared! <laughs> what are you doing? Jareth, the mate! The cracks were getting wider and Jareth was beginning to piss you me off. You can't all be doing that, cunt. What the hell are you this doing? This is where it began to get serious. That's not on, mate. That's for my Sheila. You fucking punk! Hey! Mate, I will f you up, mate. Stop this shit, I'm gonna go get You see throat. that? Fuck, Jareth. You're right, Sheila. Well, you're wearing a fucking trilby, mate. Get out. Mate. I will fucking put you on the ground. So we're gonna get ended in a second. Do you hear me? Fuck off. Fuck off, Doc. Wait, I will fucking knock you out. What do you mean you're a pacifist, mate? Mate, if you're gonna fucking start shit, mate. <laughs> oh shit. That's a Everyone fucking stop. Bitch, mate. mate, the cop's coming. We were all familiar with the sound of police sirens, inside, and so we decided to go inside and just get a drink and pretend we were none the wiser to what was we're happening here, outside. A drink. Jareth was going to take most to of the blame. Outside. That's, uh, that's Jareth's fault. You're right, mate. Fuck you! Oi! Fuck off! Fuck it! Oi, you up there, mate! Come down here! We're going to find a pick with you, mate. Fuck you, can't. Mate, 1v1, mate. Center stage. Fuck off, cunt. Fuck you. Why am I tipping out my beer, fuck? And you, fucking head boy. Fuck you. Hey! Fuck you. Mate, if you want to go... Fuck you. If you come down here... And we can talk this out like men, mate. Sounds right to me. I swear to God, mate, I'll beat the shit fuck out of you. Fuck you. You come down here. I, uh, Jamie, Jack I'm not about. gonna lie. This guy's beginning to piss me off. I'm not gonna lie. I said it then, and I really did mean it. Jareth was standing on very thin ice, and it was about to break underneath his feet. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't know what you're talking about. Well, in a second, I'm gonna beat the shit out of you. Fuck out of here, mate. I know my own. I'm silly Billy. Fucking head boy. Mate, I will fucking kill you, cunt. Fuck you. I'm getting pissed off. Getting real Fuck pissed you. off with this. Head boy. Mate, I'll tell you what, mate, I'm gonna be coming up there. I'm gonna fucking kick Fuck your ass, mate. Boy. Fuck you both. Jareth go? I don't know, mate. He was pulling people out of the cars. Yeah. Threatening to run me over. So I just lie. pulled out my gun, He's mate. Beginning to piss me off. He's beginning to piss me off. I think we should, uh, maybe teach this boy you a lesson, you know?
Boy, cunt. Jarth, what are you doing? Jarth! Fuck! Fucking hell, mate! Oh my god! You just could've fucking died! Jarth! You were shooting Somebody call a fucking EMS, mate! Jarth! I don't know what you mean, mate! You started shooting I me! I was shooting your tires, mate! I was trying to stop you shooting them! After speaking to, to Jarth, we had discovered that he had in fact robbery, called mate. the police and that they would be responding to a shots fired call to people matching our description. So me and Jamie thought it'd be best if we went and got another drink. No, leave leave Jareth to deal with it himself. After having a few drinks, me and Jamie decided it would be time to go home. But not before one last meeting with Jareth. That's into the basement. You know, the pool tables. What the fuck is going on here? The hell? That's not good. The hell's happening? Hello, you can't. Oh my god. You! Oh, I can't? What's your pro- Ugh! The hell's your problem? Mate, you're fucking fucked. Yeah, I don't call the cops on you, cunt. Jamie! Maybe we should, uh. teach this guy a lesson. Oh, oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Fuck you, Jarrah. Get in. Fuck you. I ain't gonna continue with this shit. Jarrah. Where are you gonna take. What? Now was the time. I couldn't let him get away. Fucking hell, you can't do that! Hey, mate, fuck you. You can't. Jared. Fucking hell, can Oh, mate, get in. Fuck you as well, fuck you, bro, bro, fuck you, bro, you little fucking dick. Fuck you. And fuck you. We were both down and barely hanging on. But if we made it out of there, Jared would be a dead man. Can you see the word? Uh, is that um, is that an ambulance? I can't see the word. All I see is you next to a wall. Please, sirens. Is that the police or is that an ambulance? Out of fear of Jareth coming back. I pulled together all my strength and pulled myself up. I stood over Jamie to protect him. And Jared. You do. There he is! Oh, you fucking cunt! <laughs> hey! I'm gonna get him. Kill him, please. Ah, there you go.
<sighs> You're a lifesaver. Thank you, man. Thanks, man. Have a nice evening. Jamie, you know what has to be done. Where the fucking hell is he? <clears throat> Jamie, is that you? How you doing? I'm doing fine, mate. Got here, got here in my in my heli, as you can see. Nice, fly, fly first class, I mate. Can I can see that. Very good. So, uh, what is it that you yeah. you, want, some, you brought me here to talk about? Got some business to talk about right now. So, as we know, really, mate? Jareth was a, has been a problem recently. He has been, um, to be fair. And we need to teach I'll him a lesson. We do. Right, so I have a plan. Go ahead. We frame Jareth. We get away scot-free. No, 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 not murder. What we're going to do is, we're all going to get some masks. We're going to go rob a all store. Right. I'm, I'm here. And during the robbery, oh. you will be in the car, alright? Alright. And yeah, I will be in there with Jareth. As we're... She heard too much. Must you? Uh, you'll be in the car. You'll be the getaway driver. So as, uh, as I'm we're robbing the store, I'll take Jareth down. Police will be on their way. They'll get Jareth. They won't be, they'll be none the wiser. And if he grasses us in, you know? It was, it was our, our word against him, you know. Exactly. He'll be at exactly. the he'll be at the crime scene, and we'll be we'll be away. So what do you say? Get him out of our hair forever. Hopefully, he'll be going to prison for sure. A good, that's a good idea. All right. If anything goes wrong and he takes me down, I want you to drive away. All right. I don't want you. I don't don't want you to pick him up and take him. I want you to drive all right, away. All right. All right. All right. All right. Well, he's asking me where I'm at. All right. I, I'm guessing he's at the helicopter place. So if you wanna, if you wanna hop in. It's, it's not taking off. We might have to get a car. My car's just around the corner. Let's go. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. <laughs> the little sirens are on. Go, go, go. <laughs> They still over there? I have no idea. He says he doesn't have the cops. So, we can go yeah. down there. This whole thing was an act. I was no way going to be civil with Jareth after what he did. 
It was only a matter of time before he got Jared, what was coming to him. Jared, what Jared. the fuck are you doing? Get in. Holy fuck, take your time. I was actually losing my fucking Are you mind. serious? We drove in here. There's cops over there. What do you want us to do? Yeah, the cops were asking me about some stolen helicopter. They weren't gonna fucking well, you, you, that's you why we there. fucking we fought that's why we fucking went because I stole the helicopter. Nah dude, dude, nah dude, it was me that stole that one. Oh, okay. <laughs> we, no, right. Um, that alleyway on the right, that that'll down. do. That alleyway, there's an alleyway right there. And you're on the left. It was on the right. Right, <laughs> yeah. going on there then? Up here. Hey, hey man, I'm, just, I'm scared right now. What the f Mate. Let's fucking talk then. So. Jareth. Yes. After our last meeting, I, I'm a bit, I'm a bit pissed off with you, but I'm prepared to squash this beef. If you're also willing to squash this beef. Why are you pointing at me, Cam? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. We have never had beef. The the beef, you know, when you ran us down? Oh, yeah, after you killed me a few times, yeah. I guess. No, no, look. I'm willing to squash this beef, but you're not working with me, Jared. Well... You're not working with me, Jared. I want you to work with me. You're on the back foot here, son. Oh, I can't! Stop driving erratically! Jareth. Fucking prick. I'm offering peace terms you with you. There was never any war. Uh, unlikely, that. you ran us down tw theory, You ran yeah. us all down. Look, Jareth. Peace. We can work together, not against each other. I didn't realize we were working against each other. What about when you ran us down, that. Jared? Is that your Why idea of working, working together? Because it doesn't look like that to me. <laughs> no, it's because you've got me killed. Jared, accept my peace offering. I... <laughs> all right, then, all right. Well, if you, I mean, I we have a we have a business proposition for business. you, Jareth. A trick on your. We're having a little. Uh, uh, your fucking Jesus. We're gonna have a. We're gonna make some money tonight. Sock. All right, Jareth. We wanted to know if Are you we? were in. Well, it, it depends what we're doing. All right, this is the plan. This is the plan, Jareth. The plan is. Me and you will go in, we'll be like, yo, hand over the cash. And then Jamie's going to be the getaway driver. Don't and he's going to drive us away. Don't we want to go to a gun uh, a shop more isolated than here? Quite central, you know, we go up north, Sandy. Yeah, let me have a look at my map. Oh, uh, hello. Oh, hello. Did you, uh, Jamie? Did you secure a vehicle for our, uh, our thing? That's a bad idea, as you know. If the police catch us, they'll be able to run the plate and know who it is immediately. That's a bad idea. You've got a point there. Yeah, that's fine though, isn't it? That's fine. No problem, that. Jareth. Right, 
Alright, let's get in then. Alright, boys. I'm gonna go rob it. Alright. Oh, shit, we don't have masks. Is there a clothes shop around here? Right, we don't need masks. This was our first mistake. But it only goes downhill from here. Just, just walk into the store first. Let's lie like we're buying something and then let's do it, alright? Fuck. Jesus Christ. Don't do it straight away. Alright, we do it. Put the money in the bag! Wait, are you doing it? Yeah, you're doing it. Oh my god, we gotta wait 2,000 seconds. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine. Oh no, we got. Wait, you're robbing it. Am I? Are you robbing it? Yeah, I think you are. No, you stay in here with me. Jareth, you're Let's supposed try. to be in there with me, you know, getting the guy in the bag. Yeah, yeah, oh, but it What the fuck are you doing, dude? What do you mean? I've, yeah, it's glitched out. This is from for bought before, bitch. Drive. What? Drive. Drive. Oh, fuck. The fucking car's broken down now, you cunt. <laughs> repair, repair, quick. Go! The police are coming! What are you doing? Please drive! Oh my god. What the fuck?! We had done it. We had successfully taken down Jared. Drive! Drive! I'm, I'm king trying. I could feel myself returning to my criminal past. We were now successful crooks and criminals. We were going to buy a car when we saw a man watching us from across the street. We wanted to have a little word with this person, find out what he was doing. Why he was watching us. Oh, uh, hey. How you doing? I'm doing good. How are you I'm doing? Good. I'm good. You just, just uh, looking to buy a car, you know? Saw you outside oh, watching really? us. We thought, what the fuck is this guy doing? What kind of car are you looking for? Oh, uh, a van, preferably, you know? For uh, a bit short on the old oh, cash at the moment. I, so. I see, but it looks. Um, uh, you should probably not do that. I mean, short outfit. Riding a van? I don't know, man. He's stereotyping us, Jamie. He's stereotyping van drivers. He's got, he's got a point, though, hasn't he? We're not in the gang. No. 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 What kind of... What are you in, Ben? You're not technically in any... If you're not in the gang, what are you... Okay. Okay, if you're just running, if you're just running in the street, you know, minding your own business, why don't you mind my business? I'm maybe, uh, uh, maybe I have a job for you guys. Say is maybe you guys pick up something for me and uh, you uh, package it and then you just uh, leave it to me. I'll just uh, give you some 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 money and uh, off you go. You know, maybe buy a nicer one. Hmm. How about I uh, go I mean, ahead and talk to my uh, friend here, you know, over there for a second. We can talk about this, you know, in private kind of thing, you know, and we'll come back to you with it. Yeah, sh Yeah, all right, Jamie. Yeah, okay. Jamie, come I mean, over. Uh, come over. All right. All right, so what are you thinking? Right. Hmm. Sounds good to me. I don't know about this guy. He seems really shifty. He's, he's coming closer. He's trying to edge closer to listen to us. No. 
him trying to listen into our conversation, but you know, we we can we 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 can see you. Um, I don't know what you guys are talking about. I'm just, you know, strutting around. Uh huh. Uh huh. Sure. Yeah. Jerry. Come over a second. Three, <laughs> two, one. Fuck's sake. Go. The other way, other way, he's behind us. Shit. Oi. Shit. Stand still. Oi. Let's, let's see again. managed to escape. Jamie did not. He was caught and forced to be a drug mule under a threat against his life. We decided to go into hiding. Uh, he messaged Jareth or anything, you know, maybe. No, I can do. Uh, I don't know uh, what to uh, ask uh, him. I'd hold off. I'd hold off. Oh, why is that? Oh, I remember I shot him last time we saw him. Yeah, but you know, you know forgive, give and forget. Uh, he's got bigger fish to fry. Yeah, he's not going to see it that way. Seems though, you know, kind of already already said forgive and forget, and then uh, we didn't forget. We pretended to forgive, but we didn't. Oh. And you know, we shot him outside a store. You say we. I shot, shot him. him outside of a store. <laughs> it's alright, dude. Well, we can see what he thinks. What about... Well, wait, you get him out there. I'll be, like, hid behind a wall or something. I listen... You, you talk to him. I listen to what he says. Yeah. Alright, this is what we're gonna do is you're gonna bring him over here. Alright. <laughs> yeah. Alright, tell it to you. Meet you at, meet him at the gun store, say, let's go somewhere secluded. You bring him over here, you park the car right where you are now, and you should just start talking there. What are you gonna ask him? Let's think. Something like He's gonna wonder where you are for a second. Yeah, start. that's fine. That's fine. Just say I'm doing a trucking job. Alright. Alright, say Calvin's on a uh, on a truck job, alright? On the way over, right? Don't say anything else all to right. you over here. Like, just pull the car in right where you are. Ask him shit like, oh, how are you feeling after the thing? You know, would you shoot Calvin? Or some shit like that. But it has to be natural, you know? <clears throat> it's not going to be natural. All right, just tell him. It's not natural. Just, 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 tell him you, just tell him I need your help or whatever, all right? And then just start talking about it, see where the conversation goes from there, right? See what he says, see what he says, you know? Am I trying to... This isn't natural. 
Why is it me picking up your <laughs> fucking... I just want a group conversation. Yeah, yeah. but the, we can't have a group conversation if the first time he sees me is he shoots me, you know? <laughs> you know, you, you understand yeah. the sense in that. You understand the sense in that. Just text him saying, like, Calvin ain't here. Let's talk. Without cops. Am I trying to get in him? Am I, what am I trying to do? Gun store. Gun store. In Sandy Shores. You get well, yeah, but what am I trying to do? What am I trying to do here? Right, you're going to pick him up from the gun store, right? <laughs> All right. All right, and you just make sure that he's not going to shoot me next time he's in. But don't ask him. Mate, let him bring it up first. And if he asks you on the way over, just say trucking job. And if he asks any more, just, you know, delay it till you get here, right? I can't delay it, dude. You can delay it. I, is, that, is that all we're trying to get out of it? No. You, ask it, ask I want to start a gang, dude. Ask it, yeah, and we're going to butter him up. We just don't want him shooting the other members of the gang, you know? And if I'm I don't there, think he'd shoot. I, I want to hear it. But if, if I'm there, he's going to kill me. So you just go ahead and pretend He won't kill you. He won't. I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure about that. Trust me on this one. All right? It's not, this isn't going to work. Just right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck it. Whatever. Right. So. Right. The plan. What? There wasn't, there wasn't really a plan, okay? It was, it was pretty bad, but... Yeah, I can gather. But, yeah, I mean... The revenge, I don't know. That shocks even me. And I wish he just shot me, like, straight up, just, like, shot me in the head when he saw me, not lured me, not pad me when my back was turned. I was sat in a fucking car. Well, you see, you I know... Wish he, I wish he got me as, like, oh, revenge, you know, I'll, I'll lure you into the trap <laughs> of the police and then leave. No, he just shot me while I was in the car. It wasn't even like, it was like a well planned out revenge. He could have just got me to sit in a car and shoot me. He planned this whole Look. fucking half an hour thing, Callum, where we get like a, we go rob a store and we leave. And Look, ooh, we do all this. We got there and he's... <laughs> Look, it was supposed to, it was supposed to go better than it did. Was it? Like what? Even. I wasn't even thinking he was going to betray me. He could have carried on with it. Look, I just want to, I just want... I just want an end to this this beat. No, there was an end. I I admitted it. I I accepted his peace deal on that roof, and then he shot me in the head. I don't want to be affiliated with him anymore. <laughs> I don't care about P. I don't want to be affiliated with him. I don't even want to fucking be in his own gang. Dude, I need I need a gang. I need no, a gang. No gang. No gang. Dude, I'm in he deep broke shit. It. He, no, that's bullshit. Because you've been planning it all along. He sent me. He said peace. Let's have peace. I assured him peace, and he killed me. Like what? I'm not accepting his deals. But that's that's called I a war. Still need war a gang. In the real world, Jamie. That's a war crime. I still need a gang. Can't, Hitler can't promise peace and an attack. That's what he did with Russia. That's a war crime. He might be a bit schizo, but he's not Hitler. No, no gang. No, he's very schizo, and that's what I don't like. He's very weird. And he sent me a peace deal, and then you know, I accept. Killed anyway. Like, expected a full out plan, but. Shit. I do not respect that. But. No, but. I need a gang I still. It. I need a gang you can, still. You, you can have a gang with them three, not me. Why not you, dude? You can have Niall. There. Because I've said <laughs> I'm not working with him. We but, can do. We can do normal things. I'm not being part of a gang with him, yeah. I still. I still need. I still need. I help. understand you. Still need. Yeah, you can get help. We're not part of a gang, and I'm not fucking being affiliated with him. But what Nothing happens when you meet him? him? Nothing. Nothing happens. I don't want to be affiliated with him. We'll meet. We'll you do could... normal things. But you're bound to meet at some point. No, 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 I'm not saying we won't meet. Yeah, we'll talk. But I'm not being affiliated with anything he does. I'm not riding. I'm not, you know, I'm not work. I'm not doing the same job. I'm not gonna go do some sit in the same car. Shit like that. In. If, you, if you're not going to be with him, then he's probably going to do it again. That's fine. But as long as 
he doesn't fucking betray me like that again. I don't want to be walking with him and then he shoots me in the back. Alright, let's drive. No, no right. boat. Fuck. Fuck you. Jareth was paranoid. So I needed to find out what they'd do next. Before beginning my search for them, I saw a man being held up outside the store by a group of thugs. Hey man, you all right? MS is on their way, man. When the medics arrived, they were unable to revive him. Seeing a man die like that, it changes a person. It made me want to give up the trivial competition I had with Jareth. Make amends. It was time we put our differences aside, but first I decided I'd find out what they were doing before going in and making peace with Jareth.
In order to remain versatile, I changed my vehicle. And then I carried on spying on them from above. This bar was a common place to smuggle meth across the city. It wouldn't be long till we'll be moving on. They were going fast, but I managed to keep up. I couldn't let them get away. I needed to carry on following them. They had turned into the car dealership. Now all I could do was wait. I'm on literally no help.
So far, so good. Didn't look like they were actively hunting me, and I hadn't been shot at yet. But I needed to be sure. I think this is it. This is the moment I've been searching for. The thing that's kept me going is the thought of all of us. I stood on top of a cliff with a couple of drinks next to my car, watching out as the sun goes down and is eaten by the sea. It's time me to go make amends. I feel like it took seeing death right in the eyes to finally see the way I'm supposed to be. I truly believe that my path to redemption is, in, is complete. hope that Jareth will understand and that he'll give me one more shot. This isn't the way I wanted it to go. I really did want to change. Hopefully now, this is the change I need.
I'm finally ready to change. Get out of here! Whoa, whoa.